All right, here we are, day one. So this is what you're getting ready to get to see here on YouTube. So if you want to watch us put rubber on this mobile home, like we do, this is in West Virginia. Drew's roofing and home repairs made it to West Virginia today. We've got this thing all marked out and ready. Show you what we got going on. And then this weekend, I will be downloading a video and a material list for this job. So you will know what you're going to need for material. So if you pay attention, you will know exactly what you need to do your house. And if you watch enough of my videos, check it out. This is not the only video I have. The video you're watching is not the only video I have. I have lots and lots of videos of us doing this. So look in my playlist. <coughs> right now we're finding all the tuba twos. And this is in order for us to lay our plywood. And what we've done is marked them out. Every top. And we did have somebody suggest possibly using a stud finder but um we didn't get one here this morning because i felt like there's another one here somewhere i felt like uh it's a solid piece of board okay. all the way across i felt like it wouldn't uh wouldn't work it was a cheap one i want to get a little bit more expensive one that goes through metal and everything else so we did it our traditional way we're getting ready to do like we do put plywood on this thing all the way in west virginia after we got our marks on this thing, we'll be ready to go. And so, subscribe if it's something you might want to see. This is a mobile home repair. In my opinion, at its finest. I mean, I, I think what we're doing is going to save this place. I want you to see what's going on. On your mobile home, probably, and every other mobile home that you put Cool Seal on. Cool Seal doesn't last that long. And it cracks. Look at this. I mean... Look at underneath this metal. Look at underneath that. All right, look at this. There's running water near about. Look at that. Okay, so if your metal is getting soaking wet like this from cool seal just flaking off, look at the running water. I mean, this water, where it can, this puddle, I can splash it, okay? So if you have a cool sealed roof, more than likely yours is doing the same damn thing. So don't don't let this go on forever the longer you let this go the bigger problem it's going to be this is just wet soaking freaking wet okay so the longer you have this cool seal crap on your roof the worse it's going to get over time you can see the rust coming through this thing is rusted so bad on the underside of it yeah i could take the metal off peel it all back but i'm going i'm going to actually go over it i am going over it i'm not going to peel the metal off that would be a really big job and i think this metal actually adds strength with me at putting my <coughs> with me putting this plywood on it's going to make this 10 times stronger especially 16 on center now right now i have to be careful and i want to walk on these rafters or where the lines are make sure not to walk into the centers because the centers are real weak but when i put this plywood on here and it spans five of these lines imagine how much stronger it's going to make that two by two under there because now the weight that you put on top of that is being supported through several several rafters okay so people think oh you put too much weight well i've been doing it for 20 years and it doesn't haven't had one collapse yet worst thing we've seen basically is people putting cool seal on these things and uh, instead of this rubber rubber is the way to go so if you're if you want to subscribe Hit that bell notification so you're notified when I download this video. Because this is just a before video of what we're getting ready to do. I am in West Virginia, so I have to obviously get home before I can do any video editing. And get my videos online, so um, this won't get done until... The video won't be online until uh, later on in the week, maybe next week. But if this is something you want to see get done, 